Hi, it's Brian Berg with BB Direct, and today we're going to talk about how long it takes to do a direct mail campaign. What kind of lead time do you need to give yourself? Today we're talking about how long it takes to fully execute a direct mail campaign from start to finish. What kind of lead time do you need to give yourself to fully execute a direct mail campaign? Well, for starters, we want to identify who we're going to mail and what we're going to say to them. And I strongly recommend you have a sales team meeting. If you're a small business and you don't have a sales team, then obviously the meeting is going to be very short. You sit down, you think about the kinds of customers that come through the door every day, and you think, well, how can I find more of those individuals? What do they look like? What are they what kind of income? What kind of demographics? And where are they coming from? Uh, I've got other videos that talk about that. But if you have a sales team, I highly recommend you sit down with them and you have a brief meeting to talk about this particular campaign. There's a couple of things that you can do here. You can get some insights and bits and pieces of who you want to market to and who you don't want to market to and what you want to say to them in your graphic design for your mail piece. And secondly, getting the buy-in from your sales team helps them be vested in this campaign. So this might take 30 minutes, but it could take as long as three days. Who knows? How long would you typically take to gather up your people and sit down? I say three days at maximum. And then the targeted mailing list and the design of the mail piece itself, that can be done simultaneously because you already know uh, somewhat about who you want to target and what you're going to say to them. So you can get both of these going at the same time. The targeted list count could take as short as 30 minutes, um, but it could take as long as maybe four days or even more if you have a very complicated mailing list and you want to do a lot of edits with it. And that's the same that holds true with the, the, the graphic design. For the targeted mailing list, 30, 30 minutes to four days possibly. And then with graphic design, you could take as long as 24 hours to as maybe as, as long as five days. And this is because there's going to be some edits with the mail piece. Maybe you're waiting for the logo with the high res to be given to you that you had from the website developer that you're going to be sending to the graphic design artist. So there's a lot of little pieces, but give yourself five days for the graphic design. So then there's the print and mail. This begins immediately after the targeted list and the graphic design is done. If you've committed to the campaign fully, you've made your deposit, said, yeah, I'm going to do this, let's go, go for it, it goes right into the print and mail process. And this is pretty automated. It could take 24 hours or it could take potentially a week. It just depends. If there is some ivory stock letter and uh, ivory colored envelope that needs to be ordered from a specialty provider, it may take a little while to get to. So give yourself maybe a week to get printed and distributed into the mail. That's called the drop date. When it goes in the mail, and let's just say July 9th is your, is your drop date mail date. It still has to go through the mail to get to the in-home date, which is in the mailbox. So give yourself a few days. Let's say if it's first class and you're mailing locally, well, it's going to be there very fast, one day. But if it's going maybe to the county next door to yours and it's going standard rate, give yourself two to three days to get to the, to the actual mailbox. And of course, once it gets to the mailbox, you can expect that the individual is going to pull out of that mailbox uh, virtually the same day. So as far as response, your intake team is going to take five days, 30 days, maybe three months to collect the quantity of people that responded, the quantity of people who have bought, how much did they buy, what is a dollar amount that they purchased, and what's the gross profit for that campaign. This particular process is very unique to every business. So you can adjust for these, this information, but I strongly urge you to dedicate somebody to collect this information and to make, uh, to make an accurate reporting of all that information. And then, of course, pulling it all together from all the sales team individuals, the accounting department looking at the money and the profitability. That could be an immediate process, or it could take three days or 30 days. I hope this has been helpful. Thanks for watching.